Hi, good morning, or good afternoon, wherever you're at. We are home. Um, doing nothing. I'm resting. I've got some laundry going. I just finished my coffee. Got the baby down for a nap. The kids are in the front room watching TV and um, I just got off the phone with my mom and we learned today that my grandma is going to be able to um, take a chemo pill uh, for her cancer um, that they just recently found and I'm so excited about that. That was like something that we were really, really, really hoping that uh, would happen. So, um, just a little backstory. My grandma in 2014 or 15, I can't remember. No, 2014. No, 2016. I don't know. I don't know the year, forgive me. But, um, she had stomach cancer and she had to uh, do chemo shots and um, as you can imagine that was extremely expensive um, but my grandparents are very um, good with their money so that was uh, not an issue but um, she had to do that she had to do shots and she beat the cancer which is amazing and um but just recently after well in my uh grandpa uh, passed away in december of 2020 um from mesothelioma and uh so <laughs> that was a huge um A huge 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 thing for our family uh he was like the backbone to our family like he kept us in line and um so anyways my grandma just recently uh sorry uh uh i'm very close with my grandparents so um. So my grandpa getting sick was very hard and still is to this day, but um, my grandma just uh, was recently diagnosed with colon cancer and uh, they removed the mass completely. They caught the whole mass. And um, um, sorry. Uh, they uh, took some lymph nodes and out of the night, the nineteen lymph nodes that they took, only one uh, showed cancer. Which is good, but not good, you know. One out of 19 is good, but it also was one out of 19. So, which put her into the category of chemo. Uh, and she was really dreading that because, you know, she knows that, like, she has all of us. Like, my mom and my uncle are there, you know, where she lives in, uh, my mom only works, uh, she works every day, but she works from home half, half the week to be able to help with my grandma and her, like her doctor's appointments and stuff. And, uh, so anyways, uh, like she knows that she has all of us there, but it's just different because my grandpa isn't there, you know, and, uh, 
she was really hoping that she wouldn't have to do like actual chemo so uh it, it was a very it was definitely a an answered prayer that she is able to do the pill so um we're really excited about that and uh she's healing really well from her surgery I, when i tell you this woman is like the strongest woman i've ever seen like honestly because her her stomach cancer like she had to have surgery with that and they cut her from her breastbone to her belly button just like they did on this one but they took like a lot of her organs um and I'm, I'm, I'm like drawing a blank as to what they took, but it was a really, really big surgery. So, um, this one, even though they cut her in the same area, this one was like a walk in the park, but she's done this twice now and she's seven, um, almost 77, she'll be 77 in July. Um, so yeah she's like superwoman and she is doing she's doing so well so well like she, and it just kills her though that she can't um she's not able to pick anything up for like more than 10 pounds for like um four to six weeks or something like that so that's like killing her um but yeah she's doing really good and hopefully she will get to start um, the chemo in July. So that, I'm just really, I'm really excited about that. Obviously I don't want her to have to do any chemo. We were just hoping that, you know, they'd get the mass out and there wouldn't be any cancer in her lymph nodes, but um, that's okay she'll beat it and i know she will um but if you um are the praying type just say a quick prayer for her please um it is it's not an advanced like a really advanced stage so that that's great as well so but anyways um uh but we are also today getting our new dishwasher. <laughs> the company is going to come deliver it. So, um, and install it when, I don't know, I really like my husband to be home for things like these, but he can't be home. So just be me and the kids and I'm obviously outnumbered and my kids are like crazy especially when like somebody comes to the house they like want to know and they want to see like everything that the person's doing but anyways um i am going to um sit here and drink my coffee and enjoy some quiet time while the kids are busy and the baby's asleep i need to vacuum when he wakes up and um hold some clothes so I also um kind of want to do my makeup I've worn makeup the past three two days but like I and I just feel so much better like when I do my makeup I don't know about y'all but I think I want to do like a challenge and just challenge myself to get ready at least like two to three times a week just to like feel better you know what i mean so anyways what did you guys do this again i don't know what type of vlog is gonna go up i filmed a little bit but i really wanted to spend time with 
excuse me, with my family because we had Lincoln a birthday party and all that. So, yeah. I guess we'll just bring you along for the rest of the day and see what we've got going. All right, so we are at Party City for the second time. I went in and um, didn't get enough um, streamers. Streamers. So Rob had to go in because I'm short. I'm like six. I'm six. I'm not six foot. I am five seven. Bunch of balloons. And yeah, and he is six five. So, anyways, long story short. The streamers like are up top and I had to like reach up to get it and I got caught on the little thing. Stop Brexton. I got caught and um yeah. Her sunglasses it was fun. Fell. Her sunglasses fell. Yeah. And so I sent Rob back in. Because he's to get the, and he can get to it. get the second bag of streamers. Yeah. So anyways, and then we went to Target and got the kids 
um, these cute little painting things. I'll Let me show you. show you guys them. Okay, show. Hurry, this okay. daddy gets back and we get we leave. Okay, we're gonna show them to you guys. Here is mine. No, this is This is the unicorn. This is the unicorn. Which is Lincoln's. And Next. then the dinosaur, which, which is Braxton's. Braxton's mine. And then Baker got a fish. He wanted um, the rocket, but they didn't have it. So the fish, the turtle, the and the turtle octopus. and the octopus. So okay, put them back in the bag. The fish. I want the fish in there. Okay, can Wait, you put them back in the bag. What? Why did Baker get two? Why did Baker get all three? Because they're small and they didn't have the rocket that he wanted. Um, so anyways, Why do we only get one? I want more. Because you got a big one. Mine's big too. Mine's small. You small. Baker, you got three. You get the pink one. Anyways, we're going to leave here and I don't know. I like Paint those. these at home. No, oh, you're not going to do like those tonight. This. What? It's already 7.30, you're gonna have to go to bed soon. What? <sighs> so fun. We're gonna go home, I am assuming after this, unless Rob has somewhere he wants to go. Ice cream. Did he say that while I was inside? Did he? Did Daddy say that why I was inside the store? That we were going to get ice cream? What? Oh my gosh, did Daddy say we were going to get ice cream while I was inside the store earlier? Oh, this child. Okay, put your stuff in the bag and go sit back in your seat. I'm gonna hug it. Okay. All right. Anyways. Rawr! This is a tiny room. Whoa. This is a weird room. There's Daddy. Look, look. The closet. This is so tiny. Is that like a um, office? Yeah. Hey guys, it's Baker. Oh, it's Baker. These are tiny, tiny little rooms. So we are in our neighborhood looking at houses that are being built in the back. On a walk, we decided to come look at the new houses. Ooh. Okay, so I kind of I like the master bedroom being in the back, like this. What is upstairs though? Upstairs is really, it's really not airy. The front room's upstairs. Not airy. Nope, there's not any air. So it's just a shower. Yeah, the kitchen is small. It's really hot and breathtaking. Well, yeah, it's because it's a new house. It doesn't have any air conditioning. And there's an air. It's really hot. Okay, so game room. And you have two rooms up here. Yeah, I want to get down. Hmm. Yeah, so do I. Wait, there's a room inside of the room. Okay. It's called an attic.
Okay, so I forgot to end the vlog last night. So um, here's me saying bye. I hope you guys have a great day and enjoy your weekend.